There are two reasons why this episode is a little bit short. The first one of them is I've not been feeling very well recently. Labyrinthitis, Google it. It's absolutely horrendous to play video games. But the second reason, the second reason I can sum up in two words for you. Crystal Cave. What the fuck is that? I hope you're sitting down and you're ready for this because this might be the craziest thing that we have ever done. We have absolutely never done this before at all in the slightest. It's going to be really, really exciting. It's going to be edge of your seat stuff. We are going to get some more lithium again. For like the sixth, seventh, eighth time. So on my life, my whole life is just lithium. When I go to sleep, I see lithium. When I wake up, I see lithium. Everything is lithium. And it, the, it, the only place that I've ever seen to really find it is in the place that we're going to now, which is like the big kind of mountainous uh, region area. So I'm not stopping till we get lithium. We need... Is it two lithium for each plaster lingot? And the plaster lingot, we need literally like eight of them, I think. <laughs> Am I going the right way? Yeah, here we go. So we're just going to fuck about around here and uh, hopefully get our hands on some more lithium. Oh, look at that. Oh, shit, a brick. Has he seen me? Shall I preempt zap him? Should I I need to I wish this thing had a little zoop. A thing like the prawn suit. You know, I'm gonna do it. Hey! Fuck off! I feel powerful whenever I hurt things. In video games, not in real life. You don't need to phone anybody. You don't need to worry. Right, one lithium. Let's see. How many we can get? Our good old arch nemesis lithium. Throughout this entire playthrough, we have never really been able to get much lithium. And I think that this is likely due to the fact that this biome is about as inviting as the state of your room right now. Honestly, look at it. Stop the video right now and do some cleaning, you absolute wildling. But I hated this place. The dog sea monster things constantly put me on edge. But there's one thing that I don't hate. And that's the support that you guys have been showing the channel recently. Where's it gone? Where's it gone? I'm on edge. I am on edge. I don't know if you've noticed, the past two episodes, including this one, my voice maybe sounded a little bit different. I have this thing. Can you see it a little bit better? This is my new microphone. This is the microphone that I have wanted since the day that I started my content creation journey. And the reason that I have this is because of you specifically watching this video. Everything that's happened over YouTube over the past two, three months has just been incredible. And I love this i love this i love making videos i love playing video games i love telling stories and i love editing i love everything about this i love and the fact that i'm in this position is all because of you thank you back to it i just needed to say that i needed to say it i needed to get it out of my system i definitely <laughs> I definitely didn't use it as an excuse to stop playing the game. Oh. I was getting a couple of comments in previous videos saying, new animation but sounds different. Oh my god, I hate this. Oh my god. I hate this. This place reminds me of like a Roman theatre or something. 
Like the way that he's got his, his steps and everything. I don't know. It looks Romanesque, like Colosseum Amphitheater sort of thing. Do you not think? Like, you could see the shit in Assassin's Creed and not bat an eyelid. But well, maybe the... F maybe the fact is underwater, maybe. This is good, though. We are getting a decent amount... I massively have got the heebie-jeebies for some reason. I hate the fact that the boost kind of happens and you can't control it. Like, you can't slow down. God. This is horrible. There's just so much going on visually. Oh, two lithiums. Back to back. Kind of wish these had windows, like... Ooh, out the left and right. The, there's just so much going on here from a visual point of view, but also a sound point of view. I don't know if you watched... <laughs> I am fucking fine, okay? I don't know if you watch the videos with headphones or not. If you don't, I very much recommend that you do. Particularly if you haven't played any of the Sonorca games and you're watching this, for whatever reason that might be. There is so, so much of the game that's experienced through sound. And the sound you only really get if you... The, the, the best way to watch videos always, in my opinion, is headphones on, earphones on, and watching it on um, a TV or, or a computer rather than a phone. Just because it's like... Watching somebody play a horror game on a phone is fine for me. You, you, if I sit and watch somebody play a horror game and I'm on my PC with my headphones in, it is frightening. But I, ne I never get too scared, like, watching somebody else play a horror game. Obviously, I get very, very scared. Is that a, a thing? Oh my god, I've not seen one of you in a minute. Right, how much lithium do we have now? There's another couple of bits here, no one bit. Let me get this. But yeah, I definitely get more scared. Having said that, I, I can't watch horror films. There's no way I can watch horror films. What's the scariest film I've ever seen? I remember once I went to see Paranormal Activity at the cinema, the very, very first one, and legitimately couldn't sleep for weeks afterwards. I don't know how old I was when it came out. I mean, I wasn't young. I wasn't old. I maybe was like 15, probably. 15, 16, maybe. And... Um, that absolutely scarred me. I couldn't sleep for like a week or two after that. It was horrendous. Insidious I've seen. I say I've seen. I watched through my fingers at home. And uh, what's the other conjuring as well. I can't do horror films at all. Can't do them. I'll stick to the games. I'll stick to the games. Yeah, because the games have always treated us right. And we never get traumatized at all, do we? But listen, my low threshold for being scared aside, good things happened. We got a ton of lithium, enough to last us for a while, and it now meant that we could finish the blueprint for our nuclear reactor. Here we go. Here we go. Shit. Advanced wiring kit, the three lead, the two lead, the one lead. Bosh. All right. Uh, what? All right, it's the nuclear rods. Can we put ion cubes in it? We're going to test both. 2,575 power capability. Nice. Right, let me get an iron cube out, and then we got the reactor rods here as well. Depleted. That's the point. How do you make reactor rods? I don't even know. Not me just messing with nuclear fission without even knowing what's going on. No, that doesn't work. But that does. Oh. Nice. I'm just going to use one for now. I don't want to put them all in and, like, they all start getting depleted. Beautiful. So much better. So much better. No more blackouts for me. We now had a nuclear fission reaction occurring within the base, and I'm sure that's absolutely fine, and nothing bad will happen. Next up, we rebuilt the jukebox, and this time added a few more speakers into the mix to create some surround sound in the large room. <laughs> what is this? We've got like little trance. 
I mean, that's not trans, but... Oh, this was the best one. This is the one that has the drop. We did this originally. I'm going to put a couple up in this corner. Am I out of titanium? Oh, no. We're one titanium short. Fuck it. I want to know if I can hear it, though, when I'm in here. Oh, we can. Yes. I can have a ray with all my fish. I have an idea. What if we got a bunch of these rock grubs? Although it doesn't really glow in the night. I wish, I wish you could control the lighting and we could deliberately turn the lights off. But have the jukebooks on and then just have a ton of those. Oh. It's really kind of loud for me though, so. Stop. Okay. It was then that I remembered we could build something absolutely spectacular. We could build a toilet. Oh my god. A toilet with a view. Yes. Shit. I need a pipe. <laughs> How the fuck do I build a pipe? Hold up, what else do we need here? A vending machine. Deaths need a vending machine next to the jukebox. Glass and titanium. Okay, I need to go get a ton more titanium. Sink, shower. I mean, we've got to be hygienic, haven't we? So we can have the... That there. Okay, hold up. I need to go and get a bunch of titanium. I will be right back. And so we nipped out into the abyss and gathered everything that we needed. Okay, right, got a, I mean, not as much titanium as I was kind of hoping for, but enough, hopefully, enough, just to make the bog, the bog on the sink. Uh, right, so we want to build the pipe. I don't think I've ever built a pipe. Uh... How do I build a pipe? Tools. Equipment. Pipe. Oh, that's... Oh, oh, I get five pipes. Okay. I mean, I definitely don't need five pipes, but whatevs. Here we are. Right. Get my habitat out. And construct you. And you. Oh, look at that. Shitting with the view. I can't sit on it. I've always said home is where you shit with the most comfort. And name me a comfier place to shit on this entire planet than this. Looking out into, <laughs> into the ice. And we have the sink. It's slightly wonky, but I don't really care. Uh, right, we need some glass. Do we have any quartz or glass? I don't think we do, you know. Well, I thunk wrong, because we did. Oh. Yes, and then I can be like, yep. I'll have some chips, please. See fluid intake. Oh, shit. There we go. Nice. Nice. Uh, right, I want to see about getting the coffee. Coffee vending machine. Hey, listen, this has been nice and all, hasn't it? Pretty, pretty good so far. Apart from the start of the episode out looking for lithium, this has been rather relaxing, hasn't it? A real feel-good sort of vibe. I'm going to be real with you now. There's no more happiness. Yeah, we built a coffee machine and all, but in reality, what was laying ahead for me will dwarf the warm, fuzzy feeling inside. This video is the equivalent to going out on a sunny beach vacation. Getting the most perfect vanilla soft serve ice cream from a local store. Walking out into the sun, tongue out in front of you. Your saliva begins to froth in a mouthgasm as you prepare for the first lick. 
And then a seagull comes down and snatches your ice cream out of your hand. But this seagull is a proper twat, a real bully of a seagull with a gammy leg, the sort that could legitimately mug you if he caught you alone in an alleyway. And you ask yourself, was it worth having the happiness in the first place if you knew it would evaporate? Let's cut to the chase. We went to the crystal cave. We've been there once before, but we didn't see it. The plan was to head to the cave to collect some kyanite, and if we were lucky, some nickel. So we slipped inside of Susan and began our journey. Definitely feel like it's not as easy to grapple in this game. Also feels quite glitchy. I don't know whether it's just save the game. Oof. If you haven't seen it, um, the first episode, go and watch the first episode to watch me lose all of my progress as the game glitched and crashed and we lost everything. But it definitely doesn't feel as... If it's quite clunky. <laughs> oh, that'll put hairs on your mum's chest. That is horrendous. Question is, how do we get down to that? Oh, probably this way, eh? Yeah, probably all the way down here. Oh. Voss is das. Hey up. Hey up, duck. Look what we found. Two lithium. A data box. Ultra capacity tank. Blueprint synthesized. Hold the fucking phone. Is that like a, a booster for me? Or... Like... Or for a vehicle? If it... <gasps> it fucking... Oh, it uses oxygen to give us... That's insane. That's insane. We're making that as soon as we get home. All right, what's this? Sleeper module. We already have this, but I'll take the titanium. Okay, let's keep going. That, uh, what's it doing? Just chilling. I would have never have found that. Anything this way? With this artifact, I am oh! able to trace the imprint of my people. They survived for a time, but then their presence becomes faint. Ion shit. Ion battery. That's gonna hurt me, isn't it? Ah, just a bit of scratch. How the fuck do we keep accidentally finding these? I'm genuinely scared I'm making progression too quickly because I'm like, I don't want this series to end. Because I'm just gonna become irrelevant after some naughty. Okay, let's face it. And I'm having fun playing the game. Oh, that hurts. I was literally just about to ask that question. And we accidentally found the blueprint for the ion battery. Right, anyway, uh, we need to go 200 meters that way. Okay, so big jump. Big, big jump. Okay. Shit. Wait, this is near where we got attacked by that thing. Okay, just keep floating down. Keep floating down. Wait, what's that? God, I wish it'd tell me if I've already got it when I'm in the prawn suit. Oh, docking module fragment. Oh, I know. Wait, yeah, I know. We already had them. I got excited for no reason. Oh, well. Accidental excitement, I guess, isn't too bad. What's the worst emotion to get accidentally, do you think? Accidental depression is probably up there. Accidental arousal will be pretty uncomfortable. There's nothing worse than popping a woody when you, like, it's not a good time to. Where the fuck are we going? Where's my beacon gone? Do we just do it? Do we just do it? Yeah, we're doing it. Oh, what's this? I've lost the kyanite beacon. Mercury. Oh, is that it? Oh, it's right above us. Right, to tell us to go down. <gasps> oh, 
shit. Is it down here? It was. I remember seeing this thing going, oh my god, look at that. And then it explodes. Oh. That's a massive one. Whoa. My God, am I sure I want to do this? Oh, fucking hell. This is when it started to hit me. The familiar chills, the feeling of emptiness, the sense of impending doom. For the first time, I was really, really questioning, can I actually do this? Shit. I don't know if I can do that. Fuck. Fuck. Oh, I keep to the edge. Ah. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. I thought it was a big hole. What's that? Copper. I don't want to fill up too much on copper. What was that? Please, 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 please. Please don't let there be anything down here. What do these do? Can I drill these? No. Here we go, kyanite. Nah, 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 nah. I hear something. I hear something. I hear something. Wait, what? You can just pick the kind I, I thought we had to get the drill arm. Oh my god, I'm an actual idiot. Oh, get, what am I doing? Get back in. <sighs> Holy shit. Okay, well, inch forward. Keep low. Fuck. What are these? It's like coral, but with a glowing spider's web in it. I'll actually take some titanium. I want to scan you. Jade membrane. See, there's a little crab thing there. Look, that's all right. They are, they are shite bags, but they're not much more than that. Kind of like year sevens or like 11 year olds that when they're at the playground playing park and you're walking your dog. You're still kind of wary of them, but you know in reality you could probably take them on if you had to. Not that I think about fighting 11 year olds a lot, but some of them deserve it. I need more kyanite. I definitely can't drill whatever this is. C 
see something is making a little kind of almost ethereal noise. That is a fucking propulsion propulsion cannon. Prawn suit propulsion arm. Oh wait, I knew this, did I not? No, I didn't. One out of two. Can I scan these? More lithium. I want him. I want him. Why can't you glow like that in my aquarium? I want you. Oh my god. I hate this place. Got to be some kyanite. Was I really lucky with that kyanite? Oh look, another kyanite bit there. What the fuck? Okay, we've probably got enough lithium. Let me... Get this, though. Shit, we only have fucking another couple of hundred meters. I don't know about you guys. This place feels like endgame shit. I don't think I'm supposed to be here. <gasps> ah! What the fuck is that? No, 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 no. Oh, no, 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 no. No, fuck off, please, no, no. No, I'm done, I am out of here, no, no. The combination of not feeling very well and seeing whatever in God's name that was damn near made me quit the game on the spot. Immediate terror, immediate frustration, immediate grumpiness. The thing is, though, I didn't quit the game. I carried on. More than carry on, though, I went straight to one of the alien signals because nothing could be as bad as this cave, right? Oh, no. <sighs> All the fun I was having is now just evaporated. This is the worst it's been for me in Below Zero yet. Oh shit. Oh shit, 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 shit. Ah, I said the game. I hate this. 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 Fuck off, lady. I hate this. <sighs> oh, no, 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 no. Oh, God. What's down here? What's down here? Fuck. Shit. 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 What was that? <sighs> Give me some boost. What is this? What is... <sighs> Where the fuck are we? Where the fuck are we? Is there any nickel here? Vital signs stabilizing. Do I go down deeper? Is that what you're telling me? Oh, I'm never getting out of here. There's no, I can't get. I, 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 uh, a nickel. That's lithium. What is this place? What is this place? Oh shit! Oh shit! Okay. Oh fucking hell! It goes even deeper. How deep am I? Deep. Oh, it's a thermal vent of some sort. Relax. Alien Arch architect artifact. Ground sampler. And an ion cube. 
Are you happy, Alan? I found another thing for you, accidentally. Wait, wait was this the PK bit? Maybe this was the PK bit. I, I don't even know. Is this? Do we see a green thing on? Yeah, it is. We found it. Well, what's down here? Nothing. We did it. I think. I think that's what it asked us for. It was what it asked us for. I just wasn't in the frame of mind of comprehending anything. I needed to get out of this deep, dark hole and get back to the safety of our home. <sighs> okay. We're in safer pastures now. Not that I feel any uh, um, happier about the events of today. That thing was so big. It was like... I don't know if it was jet black. What? It just moaned in my ear. I don't know if it was jet black. Or whether that was just like the lighting. But it just looked big. And that freaked me out so much. I could I can't. I can't go down there. I'm not going down there until I absolutely have to. And because the developers of this game are sadistic fox, they'll make me go down there at some point. No, no question at all, they'll make me go down there. Genuinely got me annoyed right now. Oh. That was by f Okay. Signal location uploaded to PDA. Z13. Um, why is that not disappeared? We got what we needed from it, right? All the other ones, like, automatically went away, but we did it. Z13. Well, we know where we're going next time. Honestly, I need to go and take a break. That was horrendous. I don't like the ocean. I really, really don't like the ocean. <sighs> Thank you so much for watching. I really, really do appreciate it. Thank you for... I'm doing this for you at the end of the day. So listen... If you have liked the video at any point today, please consider dropping the video a like. If you're not subscribed and you're watching the outro screen, really do I need to say any more for that. YouTube members, thank you. Thank you, thank you, thank you for your continued support. If you would like to become a YouTube member and you're not already, and you want your name in the credits of every single episode that I upload at the duration of your member, then click the join button and you can be a member of this community. But guys, thank you so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next one. Take it easy.